can we get a bang here where we can get a bang if we mix them in just the right ratio? And uh, in a moment, we have a tube here that's filled, not this one, this is an empty one, but this tube, a tube like this, is filled with uh, hydrogen and chlorine. And it's blacked out on the top and the bottom, but not in the middle. And what we're going to do is start this reaction not with a light, but with some light. Okay, not with a candle, but with some uh, glowing light. We're going to use some magnesium. Okay, so the light from magnesium, as we put it near the open window of this tube, should start the reaction. Okay. Okay, just need to find my magnesium, my tongs, my burner. Can the lights down, please? So we don't want it too bright because otherwise it will start. Okay, so before we just had it gently burning. If we apply uh, the, uh, if we mix the gases in just the right ratio, we should be able to get a bit of a bang. So I'm not going to put this burning magnesium into it. Just going to hold it near the tube. And there we are. We get a nice bang from that. Can I have the top on. Thank you. So we've seen gases burning mainly by combining with oxygen. But it is possible to have gases burning, things burning with other gases. Chlorine is one gas. It's a very reactive gas. So perhaps this would be another way that life forms could exist, not by breathing in oxygen, but by breathing in other gases like chlorine. So we could perhaps get chlorine life forms on different planets. Okay? We can get energy from the reactions of different substances with other gases other than uh, oxygen. Well, that just about finishes uh, the end of the lecture. I hope you've enjoyed it. I've got two more things just to show you just before we finish.